What's going on guys, Kaivox and Mikachi here, although you can't see Kaivox and I hate doing the intro, but here we are. We are going to be doing an unhaul slash book reorganization video today. Um, I don't do these a lot because I don't know, I've never done an unhaul video, so I apologize in advance if it's not good. But we brought all of our bookshelves from upstairs down here, so I now have a mini library and I want to try to get my red books onto that bookshelf. I need to learn to get rid of books that I don't like slash don't want to read anymore and I definitely don't have enough room on this shelf for all of these books so I definitely need to learn to let go of some of these and just stop being a hoarder. I definitely hoard books as you can probably tell. We are going to be doing a huge book donation to Goodwill very soon and I want to make sure I unhaul as many books as possible in one go so I don't have to make many trips. So yeah, this will be a challenge, not only getting these books up on the shelf and organized, but letting go of some of them. First things first, um, Strange Planet. I think these are super cute, but am I ever going to use a paper planner? Probably not, so I'm probably going to donate this. Um, Wait, are, are we doing that? For every single book? Not every single one. How long do you plan on this video being? It's be a little while. <laughs> it's it's going to be like weeks of recording. No, it's not. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to donate this one. Where am I going to put donate books? In the garbage. No. I mean... We have a, a special shelf for weird items. I'm going to probably put these two books over there because they're just kind of like, what do they call them? Coffee table books? Um, this one's actually just postcards. This one's... A mini book of little comics so they're gonna go on my special little shelf we're going to be doing a separate video for that bookshelf over there so i don't want to show it to you yet all right first off the thief famous book i didn't like it i think i'm gonna donate this right away furthermore by tahara mafi i liked this book but the bone season kaivox's favorite book he hated this book I also hate it so, much. so and i will never continue with this series so i think i'm gonna donate this as well I didn't talk about how I'm going to organize these. I think I'm going to try to organize them alphabetically by the author, which is what I did with my unread books. It's kind of difficult um, because you have to sort of know where you're going to put things ahead of time and it doesn't always work out. So Cassandra Clare books, I like these books, so I'm going to just put these on the shelf and keep those. And then I have some Marissa Meyer, The Lunar Chronicles. I know a lot of people don't like this series, but I thought it was super cute. And I'm only two books in, but I really liked it. So I'm going to keep these as well. Um, all right, M's. I have no idea where to place the M's yet, but I already have Mafi and Meyer. So we'll say the M's will go here for now. And if I have to move them, I will. How I normally do it is if I know books are in a series, I will keep them in the series order, even if they're not alphabetically correct. Um, so this happens to work out because Cinder's book one and Scarlet's book two, but if it was the opposite, I still would keep them in the order of the series. And then we have Cassandra Clare. She's going to be kind of in the beginning, so there we go. Then we have my bunch of Sarah J Mass books. Um, I know people love to hit on Sarah J Mass. I super love these books. I don't love them, but I really like them. I thought they were a lot of fun. And I like the series, and I bet that someday I will read them again. So I'm keeping all of these. Do you hear that cat? I love my kitty. Oh my god. Now here's going to be the challenge is remembering what's book one, what's book two. Uh, why don't they have numbers on them? This is difficult. I think Crown of Midnight was book two. I think I need to Google this. <laughs> All right. I'm going to donate Roar if Kaivox doesn't hate me. This is the book he learned how to spray edges on, but I really don't like this book. So I think I'm going to donate this one. And then, wow. <laughs> sorry, I love the edge, but the book is not Just great. Cut off the edge. 
Nothing to See Here by Kevin Wilson. I just really didn't like this book that much, so I'm probably going to donate it. Illuminate Files. I really liked this series. I'm going to keep it, much to Kaivox's dismay because he does not like this author. No, I like... I like the two of them together. I just don't like his other books yeah. and him as a person. All right. As, I mean, I don't know him as a person. <laughs> so Illuminae, I'm keeping. Wonder Woman, um, I have all except the new uh, DC one. The, what, what is her name? Something Canary. Black Canary. Black Canary. I don't have that one, but I have the other ones. And I don't hate them. I think they're enjoyable. And I like, I kind of want to keep this set. So I'm going to keep Wonder Woman. Um, and then I have Ruth Ware, The Turn of the Key. I really liked this book, um, so I'm going to keep this as well. Uh, throw that one out. No, I'm not. Then I have my um, Sarah J. Mass, The Thorns of Rosa series, which, I, like I said, I like her books, so I'm definitely going to be keeping these. However, do I put these before or after the other ones? That is the question think before because they all start with the letter A. So this is where it gets a bit difficult because I don't like getting rid of arcs. Um, I, I have a very hard time getting rid of arcs even if I didn't love them, but I'm never going to read Broken Beautiful Hearts again and I don't really even remember what it was about, so I'm going to donate that. I will never read Gunslinger Girl again. I didn't really like it, so that's also getting donated. Did I read that one? No. Oh, I read the other one I didn't like. Cruel Prince, um, this is an arc, even though I didn't love it, I, I know it's a popular book and I didn't hate it, so I want to keep that one. And I know people don't really love this series, but I really liked The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue, so I'm going to keep these. I have a... Um, I think one of these was an Owl Crate edition, so I'm going to keep both of them. My man, R.A. Salvatore. This is like my old... My man. My man. These are my old, old editions I read a long time ago, but I can never get rid of any of his books, so these are staying. Um, this is difficult. I didn't love the Six of Crows series, but I may give it another shot someday, and I have these cool editions, so I'll keep these as well. And then I love City of Brass. Um, Uh-oh. That sounded awkward. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> uh, I love City of Brass, so I'm going to keep these as well. I really like this um, Shauna McGuire series, the Every Hearted Doorway books, so I'm going to keep these. And then Kai Vox would chop my head off if I got rid of the Andrew Rowe books. Um. What do you mean? You don't have to even talk about those. Just they're amazing books. Whoever hasn't read them is a butthole and uh, should stop reading books and start reading so, those. We're keeping these as well. Yeah. You better put them like front and center. Don't even put them in order. Oh, don't even put them Andrew in order. Rowe. Just put them in the middle, like over here somewhere. No, not on the ground. What are you throwing this it on the, the ground for? This is the first series, right? So that's yes. going to go there. That's the second series. Come on. We both loved this book, Shadow of the Conqueror, so we're going to keep this. And then I have some more Cassandra Clare books that I'm going to keep. I have this special edition of City of Bones that I'm going to keep. Welcome to my channel. Uh, today we're going to be uh, unhauling and reorganizing Not My Bookshelf. <laughs> um, and uh, I'm just happy you guys are here on my channel, watching my channel. And um, I'm gonna let uh, Mikachu take care of the rest. Oh, it's so high up. Another series that Kaivox hates but didn't read, the uh, fantasy romance series. I don't know where book one is, but this is book three. Um, I'm keeping these. Deadly Education. No, I'm leaving. You just keep keeping things that I don't wanna keep. I know we hated this book, but what do you think? I mean, it's a pretty book. Yeah. You don't? Just keep it until I have no more room and then we'll get rid of it. Sure. Yeah. The next unhaul. <laughs> yeah. Put it on the next unhaul list. Sabriel, I didn't really love, but it's so classic. I feel like I should give the second book a try because I hear you follow a different character. So I may keep this. Rosemary and Rue, I recently read and I didn't really like, and I really don't think I'm ever going to continue. So I think I'm going to donate this. 
Um, a Curse So Dark and Lonely. It's just so beloved by so many and I feel like I don't know if I want to continue. I liked it, but I didn't love it, but I think I'm going to keep it for now. Then we have the Nevernight series that Kaivox loves. Yeah. Um, so we're keeping this series. They all die at the end. <laughs> uh, oh, and I have an Ark of God's Grave too. I'm keeping that. I was upset because I thought they were going to be immortal and nobody was going to die at the end because, you know, Harry Potter is like that and the main characters can't die. So I had assumed that these main characters also weren't going to die. But then what happens at the end is disappointing. Right, Meek? Yep. Hopefully you guys read it. Um, so I just decided something. Uh-huh. This is gonna be a multi-part series. You just decided this? I just decided this because I thought- this Nah, was be we a, can fly through this, This is this. gonna be We're a good. much quicker video. And then you decided, hey, I'm gonna talk about every, every single, single book. book. It's, it, it won't take that long. We're dude, already like halfway dude, done, dude. This is not halfway done. All of done. these are getting we, donated, ready? We did like five books. There's a thousand books right here. <laughs> it like, won't take that long. Are you kidding me? Hard again because these are arcs, but I really didn't like them. I did not like the bells, so I'm donating that. I really didn't like this book. I'm donating this, the Traders game. Wild Beauty, did not like, not continuing. I don't even know if it's a series. Don't like it, not keeping it. Mask of Shadows, overhyped, didn't like it. Ace of Shades, didn't really like that either. Time Bomb, didn't like it. To Kill a Kingdom, oh my god, this book is overrated and did I not like it, so I'm not keeping that either. The Mermaid, this was cute. I think I'll keep it for now. The Book of M, you read this. Yeah, I liked this book. pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. good. So we're keeping this one. Um, this book was cute. The, uh, the Boy, the Bird, and the Coffin Maker. I'm going to keep this one. Then I have... Yeah, get rid of that one. Andrew get Rowe. Get rid of that one. This book was awful, but it's so hard to get rid of this arc because I love the cover, but I have another copy of this and I just want to keep it for the cover. Is that bad? No. Maybe I'll keep it for now. Found my other two Illuminate books. So <laughs> Illuminate books, we're keeping those. Um, Catwoman, I like these books, so I'm going to keep that. Oh, and I said I was going to keep the um, other Lee Bardugo, Lee Bardugo books. What happened? Did you almost drop I it? I almost dropped everything. So I'm going to keep this Shadow and Bone trilogy for now as well. Witcher. I love The Witcher. Keeping my Witcher books. Peace and Turmoil. I really liked this book. And Kaivox made... Uh, cool sprayed edges on What'd it. What'd you do? You ruined it. No, I put tabs oh, in it. Oh, tabs. Okay. Silly. And the cat's ruining something. I have this super cool edition of Name of the Wind with these red edges. Um, I liked this book. I want to continue, you know, when they come out. Wait, there isn't a sequel? There is. One out now, but we haven't read it yet. Oh. Then, Wait, hasn't that book been out for like 40 years? Yeah, it's been out a while. Jeez. Uh, then I have Aurora Rising. I don't plan on continuing with this series, but I'm going to keep it for now in case I change my mind. Then we have The Test by Sylvain Nouvelle, which we really like this author and we liked this, so I'm going to keep this. Great book. This is going to go on my other shelf, but I have Tomie. I really liked this manga and I have other uh, mangas by him, so I can't wait to read more, but I'm keeping this. Um, I already talked about the... Uh, what's it called? Every Heart of Doorway series. So I'm keeping this one. Truth Witch. I really did not like this book. I tabbed all the things I hated about it. So I didn't like it and I will never continue. So I'm getting rid of this. I already talked about City of Brass and how much I like it. Um, I don't need another copy of it, but I really like it. So I'm going to keep it. Then I know everyone hates these two Harry Potter books and we didn't even like, you know, The Cursed Child, but I can't get rid of these. I just can't. Then I have Heartless by Marissa Meyer. I actually really, really liked this book. It's like a Alice in Wonderland retelling. Um, and I have this pretty edition. I'm definitely keeping this. 
I have an arc of Escaping from Houdini. I really liked this series by Carrie Maniscalco, so I'm definitely keeping this. Um, this was one of the worst books I have ever read in my life, and I don't know if I want to keep it just on principle. Isn't it like the 25th? Yeah, book it's in like the a millionth book in the series, but it was so bad that I may need to keep it just because it was so bad. It's like comical. Then Sanderson, how can we get rid of Sanderson? Skyward. The Humans, I didn't love this book, but I didn't hate it, so I'm gonna keep it for now. Um, I have some more Carrie Maniscalco. I really loved this series, so I'm keeping that. Girls Made of Snow and Glass. I thought this was cute. Um, this is an art copy, but I'm gonna keep this. Of course, I have Sanderson all over the place, so without you know having to say it, I'm keeping all of my Sanderson books, so. There's a million of them. But essentially I have all of the, almost all of the uh, Cosmere Red that are gonna come down onto the shelf, so I'm ready to put these away. Then I have One Dark Throne. I don't know why people like this series so much because I really did not like this. And even though this is an arc, I think I'm gonna donate it because I just really am never gonna read it. The Girl Who Saved Ghosts. I didn't love these books, but terrible cover it isn't a local author so i want to keep it disgusting cover <laughs> the nowhere girls i don't even remember anything about this book um so i'm gonna donate this one long way down this was cute it was okay i'll probably keep it for now uh frankenstein uh this book was all right i i, I liked it i did it was just something i wasn't expecting um, but I'm gonna keep this. I really like this edition. Prior of the Orange Tree. I think this book is a bit overhyped, but overall I did like it, so I'm gonna keep this one. Yeah, that was expensive. <laughs> uh, the Enchantment of Ravens. I didn't love this book, but I did enjoy it, so I'm gonna keep this one as well. This, I haven't read yet, but I have multiple copies, which is why this is in here, and I don't want to get rid of the arc until I find out if I like it or not, so I'm gonna keep this. You're this... also gonna keep Dune. Dune, um, well, obviously Andrew yeah, Rowe we're thank keeping. Thank you very much. And then The Secret History, oh my God, I hated this book and yeah, I, I'm gonna donate this. Bad. I just, I will never read this book There's again. only one Secret History and that is Karis's Secret History. <laughs> That's it, no, not Karis. What was his name? From Mistborn. Clot, no. Carrot, no. Karis. Is it Karis? No. Who are uh, you thinking of? The main guy from Mistborn. The one that trains... What's Ellen? His face? No, that's the prince. Oh. Um, oh my god. Karis. No. We're going to just call him Karis for now. No. No. It's... Oh my Kaladin. god. I, no. Kaladin. <laughs> um, it's... Uh, I can't think of it because you're like messing me up. Dalinar. No. Um. Corin. I just had it and you like screwed me up. Um. Um. Oh my god. Navani. Shalan. Um. Karis. Is it Karis? I think it's Karis. It's not Karis. <laughs> Kelsier. See? That's pretty close to Karis. Oh my god. So that brings us to half of the books and um, we're going to make a part two of this because Kaivox will never edit it yeah, yeah, if we make it super already. long. I hope you guys enjoyed. So far, I know I have... This looks so empty still, but... Um, it yeah, really I'm, gonna, does. I'm gonna keep working on it. You know what though? I can't get into that mindset because I can't I can't continue to keep books I didn't hey, like. Look, you know what's so. good you know what's good about an empty shelf? You can fill it. Yeah. And we don't have to spend more money. That's I know, the best part. I do have a whole other shelf of books I haven't read yet. I don't know if we can even fit another shelf. We can't. There. It's a small room. It's too small. And then we already have that one behind you. I didn't want to show people that one yet. Well, they can't see oh. it. I mean, they can see it, but. So yeah, we're gonna stop here. Um, I hope you liked this, and if so, there will be a part two soon. Thank you guys for watching. Hey, 
Don't say soon. There will be one in the future. <laughs> Eventually.、Um, thanks again. Let me know if this is something you like, and let me know if you're hating me for getting rid of some of these books. Bye bye bye. Bye.